What's going on everyone, it's your Rifle here and thanks for checking out this video. In this one I'm going to be showing y'all an awesome wall breach to do and it's pretty easy to do too. Okay, so this can be done by any ladder, you will have to use a ladder in order to wall breach through the ground. Once you have found yourself a ladder, simply start doing some jumping jacks, and while you are doing the jumping jacks, you'll then have to press that action button to grab on. Uh, <laughs> I'm just I'm just kidding guys, what the heck is the matter with me? Anyways, yeah, you just want to make sure that you do press the action button, but you actually won't grab onto the ladder. It'll actually freeze you in the animation where you continue doing jumping jacks, and you can't move whatsoever. I mean, you're not literally frozen still. You're still doing the jumping jacks, but once again, you can't move. That's how you know you got this to partially work. The next step is actually pretty simple, but it might take you a few tries to get down pat. All you gotta do is press in the left analog stick, and in case you PC users are not understanding what the heck I'm talking about, that would be the running button. So whatever your running button is, press that, and then you want to hold it downward, and then to the right direction. Once again, in case you guys are confused on this, just hold in the left analog stick, then down, and into the right direction. This should then wall breach you through the ground. I know it's weird, but it does work. I actually was taught this glitch by a smaller YouTuber named Team SNES, so thank you to them for finding it and revealing how to do it. I'll leave a link in the description to their original video if you guys want to go over to them and tell them Rifle Gaming sent you. I'm sure they'll be happy to know they got a little shout out. I have to admit, this is pretty cool. Also, a pretty cool area to do this wall breach at is right by the operations area that hasn't been released quite yet. You can do it at the ladder that takes you down into the sewers. And once you have wall breached to the ground, just tap a bunch of buttons and it should release you off the ladder onto this floating platform outside the map. And also, you can press a bunch of buttons anytime you want to get off the ladder when you want to. I don't know exactly what buttons to press. I just smashed a bunch, I'll be honest. But hey, this is a pretty sweet area here and something fun to go try and do with your friends. So on that note, be sure to share this with some of your buddies. I'm sure they'd find this pretty interesting. And it's not the old ordinary wall breach with the mobile cover that I'm sure they already know about. But uh, yeah, I guess that's about wrapping up this video. As always, though, I'm going to leave a friend reminder for you all to take a little bit of your time and leave a like. I want you all to know that it is greatly appreciated, everyone. One. That's why I say this at the end of my videos. The continued support continues to help my channel rise, and for that, I seriously can't thank you all enough. I know this may get annoying when I do say this at the end of my videos, but I'm still going to be saying it just because I like to show my appreciation to y'all. It'd be nice to see this video surpass 700 likes. That'd be freaking awesome. I mean, I'm being a little ungrateful here, though. You don't have to leave a like if you don't want to. The power is within your fingertips. At least you came here and viewed my content. That's just as appreciated. But this has been your rifle. Remember to stay safe out there, everyone. And of course, try not to sleep in pee. Peace. <laughs>